Okay, uh, time now for Conrad's Car Clinic. What? It's the car clinic time. Uh, what are we car clinicking today? Well, we're going to talk about your car when it's freezing outside. All right, that's good. You know, uh, uh, the first instinct before driving anywhere may be to let your car warm up, but that might not be such a great idea. According to experts, uh, the engine only needs... Um, you know, less than a minute to reach all of its temperatures and getting all the fluids flowing. Doesn't correctly. matter about age of the car. Or Doesn't the really the car? matter okay. about age of the car. So once the fluids get flowing and everything's working, which happens, you know, shortly after you start it, <laughs> sort of like um, me this you're morning. good to go. Right. <laughs> uh, you know, the other thing I wanted to talk about is is your windshields. So you know, when it's this cold out, now we didn't see it quite this cold, but I've I've had some. Uh, uh, some frost on my car. Well, when you have these little marks in your windshield, the the little chips and stuff, you know, you got to be real careful how you first off clean the windshield and second off how you defrost the windshield. So if you put your defroster on max get it temperature and then crank it up, there's a high probability that little rock chip is going to spread to a big long crack and that's going to go across the windshield because you got to remember a windshield is basically two pieces of glass with a piece of plastic between mm -hmm. them. The film. So if you heat the inside glass up faster than the outside glass, the inside glass expands and that will basically run those cracks. So instead of cranking it up to 90 degrees to heat the inside windshield up, just set it on 60, 65, let it eventually come up to temperature it really doesn't take that much longer to melt the ice off your windshield because you definitely want the ice off your windshield before you head on down the highway no. A plastic credit card will get the a, ice a off the full windshield. Credit card, yeah. Full tilt boogie. That's Dude, when I lived in San Antonio, one of these little cold fronts came through. One morning, I backed out of the garage, and that rock chip went all the way across. Just hit, hit sure, the car there. Yes. Because you yeah. can just kind of hit the flex in your car as you're backing down the driveway. And it makes and a very unique sound. Run <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. So, uh, you know, being careful uh, with how you defrost your windshield is important in these days. That's a, that's a very good information. Thank I like you. that. Yeah, that was good. Um, yeah, and, and it'll also make you have to change that cracked or... or damaged windshield quicker mm -hmm. yep. by doing it that way. So if that's the case and you've got insurance, then crank it up to and 90 degrees. You betcha. Well, and those those uh, people out there that can fix the rock chips, do it. Because I, my opinion is it's yep. probably stronger than it was before because they pull all the air out of it and fill it in with a glue. Allegedly, yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Allegedly. Thank you. Um.